It's lovely to meet you, Lucy. Lovely to meet you as well. All right, so we're going to be doing your annual um, health yeah. exam today. Okay. Um, is there anything in particular that is wrong with you or that you want me to focus on? Yeah, I have got a few injuries from dancing. My shoulder and my hand um, and my hip and my knee are a little bit sore as well. Okay. And it's all on one side. Okay, well, and your left? Yeah, left side. So tell me about these injuries then. Are they... So the shoulder pain? Yeah, it's... Um, I'm not sure if it's like a knot or if there's something that's a mm. bit like cracky in a way. Okay, and does it hurt all the time? Yeah, yeah. It's like crunchy as you move it. Okay, hurting now? Yeah, and it just I feel like it affects my posture because it hurts. Mm. Okay. Um, and your hip? My hip, um, well I've got a label tear, so it's just sometimes obviously it can hurt more than others. Okay. Um, and where else did you say? Uh, my knee. I think it's almost like a fluid, maybe, in the side of the knee, it's just a bit more swollen okay. than the other side. Okay. And where else did you say? Uh, like my hand and my wrist. And this is all on your left? Yeah. So this is probably from repetitive movements? I think so. I think I'm a lot weaker mm, on the okay. side. And have you had your annual blood tests to check if there's anything else underlying? I haven't yet, no. Um, because there are some conditions that mm. can create muscle weakness, oh, which can okay. lead to injury. Mm. So that's something we'll check today. Okay, thank you. And then in addition to just having a look at some of these injuries you've mentioned, I'm going to do a general health checkup. Okay. So that's your lungs, your heart, um, your abdomen, uh, your skin, okay. neurological. Yeah. Okay, okay, great. Does that sound thank all right? You. Yeah. There. So we're going to put some gloves on mm -hmm. and then I'll have a look. Okay. So it's alright. Just get used to just sit as you would normally, don't force anything. I'm just going to have a general look. So you've got a good colour. Um, do you feel unwell apart from the pain? No, I feel fine. Okay. Eyes are a good colour. The glare of the eyes, the whites. There's no redness on the chest, on the arms. Let's have a look at your hands. A little bit cold to touch. Yeah, I do get that quite a lot. Yeah. Okay. Let's have a look. Skin tone is good, is not um, showing signs of jaundice or any potential kidney issues. What we'll also do is have a look at your scalp okay. in, um, in regards to the skin um, exam, just to see if you have any lesions or moles or anything. Okay. It's a yeah. bit suspicious. Thank you. Perfect. So. I'm going to start off with your heart, okay. so I'm going to just have a listen. Okay, while I'm here I'm going to have a little listen to your lungs, okay? okay yeah. 
So we're going to do this side first. I'm going to have you take a nice deep breath in. And out. And again. And out. And again. And out. And again in, and out, and then just breathing normally. Okay, there's no signs of wheezing or any mucus build up. Are you coughing much? No. No? At night, is your breathing waking you up at all? No. Okay. I'm going to check your blood pressure. Okay. okay. Have you experienced any fainting? Um, no, but I have normally got a bit of a low blood pressure. Low blood think. pressure. Yeah. So do you sometimes experience dizziness? Yeah. Okay. Have you and then just relax the arm. I'm going to ask you to just hold this for me. Just relaxing, making sure that nice and relaxed there. Okay, yeah. A little on the low side, but yes. within the normal range. Okay, yeah. Okay. Okay, now I'm going to do something called a heat exam. So it's your head, ears, eyes, nose and throat. Okay. So we'll start off with the head. Any pain? No. Any headaches or no. migraines? No. Okay. Just have a look at the symmetry of the head for any inflammation. Okay. 
Okay. Swing down the neck a little bit. Okay. Alright, that seems okay. So I'm going to have you just look over this shoulder and I'm going to take a look in your ear. Any issues with your hearing? No. Any itchiness? No. Any loss of fluids through the air? Any bleeding? No. Okay. Turning, looking over the shoulder. Okay, that's great. So there's uh, not a build up of wax. There's no redness, there's no um, spots or oozing of any pus, so it looks really healthy. Um, I'm just going to check your hearing. Okay. So if you could just focus on a spot in front of you and then just close your eyes. Did you hear that? Yeah. 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 And which side, left or right? Left. Okay, just let me know when you can no longer hear the sound. No. No. Okay, that's perfect. Well done. Um, so, hearing is good. Um, any issues with your balance at all? Do you feel like you're sort of tipping or no, losing okay. your step? No. Mm. So, I'm now going to take a look at your eye. So, um, what I'm going to do first is have you look at my ear. Okay. Just going to lift your lid slightly. Look down. And then look up. And then still focusing on my ear. And down. And look up. Okay. Yeah, uh, eye health is really good. Um, as I said, there's not um, it's a good amount of fluid in the eye. The sclera is nice and white. Pupils look healthy and the iris is lovely and full of colour. I'm going to now I'm gonna have you just looking at the light here, okay? I'm gonna have you just follow. What I'm checking for is eye movement, any jerkiness. And that's lovely and smooth. I'm going to ask you to just hold this over one eye. Okay, nice and close. Just looking at a spot ahead of you. Okay. And then just swapping the other. Okay, and now I'm going to ask you to put this directly between the two eyes. Perfect. Pupils work really well together, really good pupil reflexes. Yeah. Just focusing on the spot ahead. Pupil size. Okay. All really healthy. I'm good. So, nose health. Um, any issues with your smell? No. Um, any issues with your taste? No. No. And 
um, any sort of um, running of the nose, anything that's a little bit out of the ordinary. Mm. I'm just going to touch the nose, so if you just nice and get nice and still. Any pain? Mm. And I have just a very quick look. Perfect. Nose health is great. Wicked. So throat. I'm going to have a very quick look at the back of your throat. Okay. okay. Just with this light, I'm going to have a look at the top of your mouth and your tongue. Okay. And that's it. Thank you. Alright, so just open your mouth in a comfortable position. Okay, I'm just going to use my light. Perfect, tongue's nice and healthy. There's no spotting. Do you suffer with a sore throat? Mm. No. Um, any sort of itchiness? Mm. And when you wake up in the morning, is there any sort of soreness? Mm. No. That's wonderful. Well done. Okay. Right. I just now want to check your temperature. no sign of um, a temperature which suggests that you are well and there yeah. is something else going on inside yeah. there. there. Um, okay, I'm going to have a feel of your neck now, of your um, main arteries, lymph nodes and your thyroid. Okay. So I'm going to have you just focus straight ahead. I'm going to feel your glands okay. and I'm just going to put my hand underneath the arm okay. just to feel for any inflammation of your main f uh, lymph node groups. Okay. So, I'm going to feel the glands. Left is slightly enlarged, which isn't a problem, it just might mean that working a little bit harder than usual. Probably nothing. I'm gonna just feel under your arms, so just... Okay, I'm on the other side. All feels wonderful. Mm. Okay, what I'm going to do now is just test um, your neurological system. Okay, so I'm going to have you open your hands up like this and try and don't let me close your fingers. Perfect. 
and then just pushing against my hand on the other side and then outwards is that okay? yeah that's not causing too much pain mm. okay. I'm going to ask you to close your eyes and I'm going to check your cranial nerves um, we're going to start with the facial nerve so I'm going to ask if you can tell me whether this is sharp or soft sharp the end of this, just a touch around your eyes, let me know if it triggers any pain. And if you just close your eyes, I don't. Any tingling, numbness? No. And you can feel all of this? Yeah. You can feel this? Yeah. And here? Yeah. Down your arm. Yeah. Down your arm. Okay. If you just hold your hands out in front of you like this and then close your eyes, I'm going to touch you on a particular finger. Just let me know if it was the left or the right hand. Okay. And then just let me know how many fingers. Two, three, one, zero, five. Okay, perfect. Right then. I would just like to check the reflexes in your joints okay. um, just to make sure that your nervous system is reacting. Okay. So you might feel a little jogged. Look at your moles, which will include a scalp inspection, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to have you lay down, and we'll focus on your abdomen and your joints. Okay. So, feel free to close your eyes for this element. So, a few new moles from the last time I saw you. Any moles that uh, you've noticed that are worrying you or that have popped up? Mm. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna just have you turn around now and okay. just clear this. Okay, I'm gonna have you turn back around. I could just have you come a little bit closer, just on the edge, as close to the edge as you can go. I'm just sitting forward at home. Okay. And I'm gonna have you just look over this shoulder. Perfect. your I'm going to ask you to look over this shoulder I'm just looking over this shot. So what I'm doing is just checking your hairline because it's slightly thinner and there is just as much risk in skin damage as there is in your exposed skin. So just 
just making sure I check. lay down now. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna just feel now your stomach. Any stomach pain? No. Any sharp sort of pain at all when I'm touching? Okay. Can I just pull this tiny, tiny little bit? I just want to feel under the belly button. to the rib? Mm. Okay. Okay. Abdomen seems nice and clear. Having a look at your joints while well, I've got you nice and relaxed. Just gonna do some movements. Just wanna compare this one. Is that where the pain is? So it's nice, more like this. this one. Mm -hmm. Pain when I'm pressing here. Mm. Can I just have you lay on your side facing this mm. Just relax in the arm. Any pain here? Mm. Usually is in the shoulder. Same okay, so on the shoulder joint yeah. to the back uh, yeah. there. Okay. Okay, and then the hip pain. I was going to ask you to bring this leg. Sorry, this knee towards your stomach. Okay. And it's in. Is it towards the back? In no, the side? Front, I think. Okay. So we'll have you in for a scan. Okay. We'll have that checked. Okay. Maybe we'll tear. Just relaxing the leg. And then can you just wiggle your toes and turn your ankles? And that all feels alright? Yeah. Okay. your hand on the bed there. Okay. 
And then in terms of your wrist and shoulder, I'm going to have x-rays of everything. Okay. And we'll look at whether we need to do any work, any physiotherapy. Okay. jump up and um, we'll discuss the findings. Okay. Right, so I am really happy with everything. Okay. I think you're in very good health. Okay. We are going to have the x-rays done yeah. of these injuries, which I'm okay. a little bit worried about. I okay. don't want you to be potentially making these worse. Okay, yeah. um, there is something you could do in regards to your diet, which okay. might help with yeah. inflammation in the body. Things like turmeric, black pepper, okay. um, reducing your dairy, uh, things like that could make a okay. big difference. Okay. Um, lots of dark chocolate, yes. a tiny little bit of red wine if you okay. enjoy that. Yeah. These things have antioxidants and they're really good for you um, and should sort of make you feel a little bit better okay. um, from a diet perspective anyway. Um, lots of water, yeah. lots of vegetables, green yeah. veg of course. Um, and then if we do find any inflammation um, on the x-ray, I will give you something directly for the inflammation to take, okay. just to help reduce that pain. Thank you. Yeah? Yeah. Thanks. Perfect. All right, I will have this all written up and um, get it sent over to you. Okay, great. Thank you very much. Right, well, it was lovely to meet lovely you. To meet you. Yeah. And, um, thank you. Yeah, we'll speak soon. Okay, thank you.